Hello YouTube, in this video tutorial we're going to be making your first program, well running your first program, Hello World. And so first thing you're going to do is click File, New, and Project. Now go down here, select C slash C++, and then C++ Project. We're going to name the project Hello World. There you go. Now, we're going to use the Hello World C++ project. It's in, it already exists. Now, this is pre-done within Eclipse to sort of get your first project and see how C++ works. Now, we got to use the MinGW toolchain. That's the one we installed earlier. Go ahead, click Next. And enter your name for author. Copyright notice. This is going to be... Uh, public domain slash GNU general public license version 3 hello world greeting hey, I mean what do you want to put in here let's say you can leave that and source is just going to be SRC which stands for source next click finish click OK in case that does come up so First of all, you're going to go up here and you can see everything that you have here. So the name of the program, hello.c++, c++ is the file extension for C++ files, the author, me, version, you can go ahead and type in 1.0, then control S to save, copyright, public domain GPU, GNU, JPL, and description so it just says it's hello world in C++ and in NSI style so first thing we're going to cover is these dash dash that stands for commentary basically and if it's in a dash dash it will not get added to the program at all it's basically it won't even get compiled it's just here for your information and it's basically um, commentary ignore these for now and the main important part is this right here and you're going to see there's an int which stands for integer and then we have a function main you'll know if it's a function in general if it has uh, regular uh, parentheses and then uh, you have to add a curly q open bracket and curly close bracket okay so this is the function and main is usually what starts the program so integer main function and these are nested as you can see there's a start and a close now C++ is very picky with uh, syntax and uh, spelling so you have to be very careful C out there's two versions C out and C in so let me type what they look like one is C out there you go and one is C in that's your basic IO input and output now here we go, this is C out, so output. We're gonna output this text right here, and it's gonna say, now it's being quotes by the way. Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, hello world, exclamation point times three. Then we go to end, and then commentary, which just basically is for your information, and it says prints hello world so prints it's gonna display it to the screen and we're gonna know that down here in the console and so basically this is gonna go line by line it's gonna start here gonna go down program starts through the function main it's gonna display this output it's gonna end it and it's gonna return to zero this is very basic just return to the starting point or just end since we already end the program it's going to go back to zero and since it's ended it's not going to do anything since we're not looping or going through any variables and then you have your curly end, end bracket since they have to be nested within the function we have to build or compile this. so to build or compile you can right click on the project and you can do build project now this will build the, the folder and the project and it's going to make it into a exe file 
And then we're going to have to run the project. So to run, just go ahead, click run, run. And it's going to say that it's been modified since we edited some things in here. We added the 1.0. And so you're going to save it to your project and it's going to rebuild it again. And then you get your output here and it says hello world. Now you can change this. So in between these, let's take out this commentary because we pretty much know what it does already. Highlight this text and you could change it to something like my name is Ian. What is your name? This is my first C++ project. Now, when you click run and run again, it's going to say it's been modified, so go ahead and save it. And it's actually going to rebuild it. And you're going to see the output here, and it's text output since it's an integer value. And it's going to say, my name is Ian. What is your name? This is my first C++ project. Now, we're going to end it here. I'm going to say congratulations. You've just compiled, built, and ran your first C++ project successfully. And you can pretty much tinker with this. Since this is the only thing we've done, you can look right here. You can play with this. Anything be between the quotes, you can add in anything, any text, numbers. Basically, um, sort of like a sentence. We haven't learned anything about using functions or variables to solve math problems, but we're going to do that next, and it's going to be a Celsius to Fahrenheit conversion. So with that, I'll leave you guys off, and congratulations.